Hey, have you ever eaten a Jack in the Box? Well, we did, and today's review is going to be on that. So, shout out to our friend Amberly and all the staff at the Jack in the Box store number 8130. You know who you are, right outside of the Denver airport area. Christy and I decided we were a little angry. We don't want to get angry after a flight. Very nice flight out, so follow along, guys and gals. we got a lot of stuff coming up. Like today's review on the Jack in the Box location, our new favorite go to for burgers in today's we review video all right so i have got my first jack pack jack in the box, jack in the box. hey there hey. say hello to everybody <laughs> hey where are we we're in denver jack, yes at the jack in the box a new restaurant we've never been to look at this so we have got our first jack in the box meals Ooh, and nice. here's our receipt we bought two burgers now, I got one on the recommendation of our wonderful server up there. She said you should try out one of the two, number seven or the number one, so I did. And so for two burgers, now this is right off the interstate, mm -hmm. right outside of Denver. It's only $19, and these things look really good. Let's check them out. And while we're waiting, this is the inside of the restaurant. Yeah, they even got like a little fire pit area, probably when it gets really cold. It's a really neat little restaurant, and it, very, very off the beaten path, this location where we're at. But, thought this was really cool because you can actually see the fireplace from the outside. Pretty neat. But we're in a neat little area uh, close to the Rocky Mountains. Of course, the Rockies are all over us, but we landed at Denver, and we are now getting ready to check out our very first Jack in the Box. So are you ready? Look, I'm ready. Let's check it out. Look what you got now. You got the curly fries. So this is my cheeseburger. All right, let's check it out. Just a regular? All you got was just a plain Jane cheeseburger. All yep. right. Let's see what you think. Oh, with pickles. Ooh. I gotta take this. Somebody's gonna get a bonus pickle. All right, Christy, so it's your very first Jack in the Box. Mm. What do you think? Mm. Really good. Mm. Yeah, it's got a great, looks like a brioche style bun. So let me get mine out it's and see. Like oh, oh, nice. And mm -hmm. she's got the curly fries. So I'm gonna check out mine. Hi. Hey, and so I actually got, it's really nice because the young lady up front gave me her input on it. We talked about anything bacon, so I want you to look at how beautiful this is. Oh my gosh, is. look at that thing. This thing is, look at wow. that. It's like a mama's apple pie, look at that. It does. Now this is a bacon and Swiss burger. Wow. On a very, very, very nice looking meal. That looks bacon. very good. And then I got regular fries. Let's give it a bite. All right. This is my first, not only Jack in the Box, but it's my first Jack in the Box in Denver, Colorado. <laughs> look at that. That looks good. Mm. Oh yeah. Two thumbs up. <laughs> oh yeah. All it's right. got some kind of a special sauce in it. Nice. Oh yeah. All right, peace out. All right, so it looks like 1951, they started their first drive through. 1969 was their first breakfast sandwich. And then it looks like in 1979, that over a thousand locations. 92, uh, Jack goes public on the NYSE. 95, they often the, uh, actually came back with the Jack's Back campaign uh, with the former speaker box clown and Maverick of the CEO of the company, that one right there. But anyway, they are different. Um, this is something I thought was really cool. I don't know if you guys can see that. Let me get out the light there. But in other words, they don't make this until your food uh, gets ordered. And I thought it was really, really good. 100% sirloin burgers and great variety. So. Anyway, Jack in the Box, great location. I don't know if you all have ever been to one or not, but we will definitely go back again. Jack in the Box. That just went down. That was cool. That was really good. I liked it. We definitely will go back to a Jack in the Box again. And shout out to the staff of the Jack in the Box just outside the Denver airport. I don't know what this location is, but I'll tell you what, I would go to a Jack in the Box any day of the week. It was very good. It was really, really good. Let me show you guys this. Hang on. This is the air, the area that we're at, and it's kind of weird because you're way over there is the Denver airport, and you don't see anything for miles, a little bit until you get out here, and then you start seeing a little bit of mountains roll in, and it looks like we're getting ready to maybe get hit with a little bit of a storm and all, but this is a really, really neat place. Like I said, it's just located right off of the uh, I-70 West as you're heading out by the Home Depot, so definitely would go back to a Jack in the Box again. It was really, really good. Look at that, Mama's happy and we're on our way. Can't tell you where we're going because we got more trip surprises coming. Thank you to the staff at this location. It was really, really good food.
Yeah, and thank you to all the people that we've met along our trip. Hey, follow along. we got some really great videos coming up, like a trip out to Moab and all around the Arches National Park. Keep watching. More videos coming up right here on We Review You.